Hey, what's up guys? This is Chinas from Chinas Cubing, and today I will be making a video telling you what to learn after beginner's method. If you want to get better and you're still using beginner's method. So, what you want to learn first is F2L. F2L, I'm going to scramble my cube and then explain. Okay, so F2L is pretty much, it's a step, well, actually first, you want to make it so you can do cross on bottom without putting it on top, so like that. But F2L is pretty much first two layers. So you first make a pair, which in this case is already one made, and you insert it. Now, I'm probably not going to make a tutorial for this, but there's multiple ways that you can learn it online. Like, there's a video made by JPerm, I believe, and there's a really good video by Laser Monkey. So, I'm going to finish this solve. Okay, then after that, after you learn F2L, which it should take you about a week to actually start understanding it, you learn to look OLL. So, you'd probably start out to look OLL starts out the same as normal OLL redo that but then you do instead of doing soon to get one of these cases let's see if I can redo this so, dang it so but pretty much I'm gonna set up I'm gonna do that again I'm probably going to cut that part out. <laughs> okay, so you're going to start off like doing it normal, but then instead of doing the soon case or the one that you would to get the fish, you would do a different alg they'll orientate all the corners. Then Tulip PLL is oh and where you can learn this four look last layer, two look OLL and two look PLL is it's a very good um algorithms on a place called Dan's Cubing Cheat Sheet. It's you literally just type in Dan's Cubing Cheat Sheet and look for four look OLL and you'll get all these algs. Then you want to get the where all the cor corners are in the right spot. In this case, it's there's no headlights, so you would do a wiper, and that just happens to solve it. But most of the time, I have to set up this case. You'll get something that looks a little bit like this, where there's headlights and like and nothing else. So what you do is you do a J-perm, and then you get a case like this, which this is a U-perm. You probably already know that, but that's what you'd want to learn after to look or after beginner's method. If you want to learn, that's that's the CFOP method. There's also RU. RU is where you make one block on one side and another block on the other side, and then you do all last layer only doing M moves. It's I use it after beginner's method. It's actually a pretty good method before going into F2L because it you understand how F2L works and you and if you use Dan's Cuban Cheat Sheet, you actually learn two look OLL and two look PLL using it or most of the algorithms. I would not learn ZZ right after beginners or but or Petrus. Petrus is not one either. But so after beginners, just to recap, you, after begin learning beginners, you and you want to get faster, you'd learn F2L or you'd learn how to do cross on bottom without doing the flower on top. You'd learn F2L, which is pairing together two pairs. You'd want to learn 
Tuluk Olo and Tuluk Pilo. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for I might be making a F2L tutorial and a Olo or Tuluk Olo and Tuluk Pilo tutorial. And goodbye.